Hello friends, welcome to my channel. So when we are looking at the current price chart of KTRA stock and uh, you can clearly see a massive fall. But then again, the way the stock is behaving, it looks like that uh, it is trying to bounce back higher. Obviously, it's going to be a trading bounce back, but you can clearly see a narrow range. Okay, you can clearly see a narrow range. So if this works out, you will definitely have a bounce back and the stock right now trading above this range, which means this is a price breakout that has happened above 0 0.10. Now, what do we want from KTRA stock? First of all, because the stock is now trading and sustaining above 0 0.10, so 0 0.10 is going to be your support. And we have 0 0.07 as far as this stop loss is concerned. So please do not go below these two specific levels. And most importantly, below 0 0.07 otherwise a downside will start again now what we are analyzing <coughs> is just for the very near term which means the stock is first of all volatile number two the trend is on the downside and number three the stock is trying it has fallen so much that i mean sometimes you will see a fatigue even in the trend and that's why you will see a bounce back which you may call as a dead cat bounce as well so if the stock continues to trade and sustain above 0 0.10 you will see a bounce back towards 0 0.50 or it will start with 0.24 and can jump up to 0 0.50 so even if the stock bounces back higher it does not mean anything because this is just for the sake of uh, you know uh, a trading or it will be considered as a trading upside which may or may not sustain now will it go big it depends it depends let's say if you want to go beyond 0 0.50 or more then let the stock surpass and sustain above that right now because of this price breakout this highlighted section is something which has now become active and that's what we're going to look at as far as the price jump of ktra stock moving forward so this is the end of the video thanks for watching